I knew I had a purpose, but didn't know how great it was. I'd heard the stories about champions. but had yet to meet one. I dreamt about Sky Dome, the temple above the clouds. But this was the first time I'd seen it with my very own eyes. Here back another video this time around we are playing sky dome i was lucky enough to get invited to the closed beta the whole game is under an nda so you will first see this in the future uh, but i'm uh, allowed to record footage uh, pre-handedly and then when the nda nda gets lifted i can then pre uh, pre or release my videos i can show you guys what this game is all about so it is published by gamigo but it's not produced by those guys it's a company with a k or something like that it doesn't really matter but it's just gamigo that are publishing it here uh, at least in europe and in na as far as i know but in this video we're just gonna go over the whole like lobby and stuff like that and then in, in some other videos coming up we are going to do some gameplay video of the tutorial and maybe it's a quick match we'll see how it goes but for now we are just gonna look around in the lobby and talk about game so far because i've only opened the game so far and looked around a little bit so just get a hands-on before we try it uh first playthrough so first of all we are going to look at the play button right up here so we of course we got the tutorial we do have to finish that before we can unlock the training matches and then of course you can do quick match i don't know even if that's going to be anybody playing it because it is a closed beta and like i said there's a whole nda on it and all that stuff so yeah, I'm pretty sure that not a lot of people are going to be in the quick matches because I think this is between uh, two, uh, sorry, um, four to eight people, I think it is. But we'll see when we get into the tutorial. It is a Dungeon Defender-ish game where you just see it more from above, like you do in the old Warcraft games and stuff. You do have a hero and then you defeat, like, you defeat a, a horde of things coming through your uh, your maze and whatever stuff like that but it's like, it'll be much more clear as soon as we do the tutorials and stuff so these were the play buttons let's go under collection so this is the heroes i don't know if there's gonna be more heroes coming in uh but this is at least the heroes there are you can't really see the ones down here but i can hover them and so you can see them a little bit better these are just the small icons i know my big face is covering all this but it's a lot easier for you to see them right here so this looks like one that has like the ballistas and stuff like that and then you got this big ogre guy that has a big cactus in the back and you of course you got this guy oh he looks cool with those he is going to smash uh, hopefully he's gonna be like a lot of smashing there then you got a little bit more of an engineer uh, kind of dude or i guess he's more of a uh, blacksmith dude and then you got this guy this is like more of a brewer that is one big brewing stand and then you got a little bit more of a fighter and, and a wizard. And this is the uh, kind of, this was the guy you saw in the uh, intro and stuff like that. It was just a small intro that's kind of just uh, abducting me into this world. <laughs> and then you got this girl. Oh, she looks fun. I like that. I like that. It's a little fun. And then you got the gardening guy that you saw in the uh, back there. So let's just click this I'm guy ready. here. So of no course you got what. the, you got the, uh, the skins, you got the, that skin and you got this skin instead. So I don't, at this point, I don't think there's much variety in the skins. There's this skin as well. Just basically a different color. Uh, I can't buy diamonds at this point, but we can get obtain, of course, uh, coins. Uh, you're going to do that through just playing the game like uh, League of Legends has. You know, you have just something you buy for real money, and then you have this for the 
uh, coins as well. I like that you have to, you know, buy with real money. Of course, you have to buy skins with real money, but you also have to use the coins so you can just can't go out and buy all of it at once. Uh, there's also some default poses. Uh, you've got the default poses. That's the victory poses. This, then there's this pose for victory as well. And then you have the details that kind of details all of his skills and stuff like that. All the things he does. Uh, you can't see what it does because again, my big face, but it doesn't really matter. You, you'll see it in game. We'll probably play this guy uh, as we can. You can just click uh, to, to whatever is to wanting test. to go there. That's, this is Egon. Um, then you got, of course, some, uh, some account stuff where you can see all like banners and your uh, different wall skins and items and all sorts of stuff. But yeah, what I hope they will do though is that they will. Right now, everything is unlocked, and I don't know if that's going to be the only heroes that are going to be there. I doubt that's going to be the only heroes. I think they're going to introduce other heroes as well over time, of course. Um, but you can level them up. That's I think you can level them up. Places. I think that's why it says uh, zero out of six because I haven't played it. I think you can, might be able to level them up. I'm not sure. But the point is that I hope that you can unlock them with the gold, gold coins so you don't have to buy them. Of course, there should also be an option for you to buy them if you just want to buy them for diamonds, if you're just you know, filthy rich or something like that. But I think it should be unlockable by coins. Not the skins and stuff like that, but League of Legends, you can also... Uh, unlock uh, champions with your the blue essence you have. I think the coin should be the same where you can unlock it here if you have a bunch of it. Um, other than that, I don't know what the coins are for at the moment. The shop is just kind of limited into, you can see the, the skins, which you of course can't buy because you can't buy diamonds. But you also have a battle pass, which is pretty cool as well. You get some exclusive stuff. As you can see, it ends in nine days, the battle pass. So it might be able to on, uh, I'm thinking maybe at the NDA gets lifted after nine days because that's the closed beta battle. Uh, I, I can't get premium because I can't get uh, I can't get I can't buy these, which is uh, kind of funny. But uh, I think these this is gonna be maybe the uh, battle pass, the first battle pass. You know, as you know, it would be silly if the closed battle or beta battle pass would be basically. The closed one if that makes any sense but yeah you can buy the ba battle pass but uh then you will get these premium rewards but i think the, these free ones is just when you level up you get these free ones but if you have battle pass if you have these um these premium ones you can get better probably probably better see it when i do it like this uh these will be uh unlocked you know when you have the the battle pass but i don't think you need the battle pass but maybe you do get the you need the battle pass anyways but i don't know how the battle pass works but we uh we'll see you even get some diamonds with it so that's pretty cool but yeah all this free stuff uh we'll see what that is and uh, how it gets along it's all the way to i think it was 50 i think that was 50 yeah the 50 is the last one here and that's our king egon so that is that is a boy pretty cool i gotta say that's a very cool skin to be honest compared to what he has at the moment right now so yeah, that was the battle pass. So other than that, there's not really anything else. Uh, there's some, you know, you can see your history, your competitive and all sorts of stuff and how you played and most played champion and stuff like that. Just, that's basically just your profile. And of course, there's a playlist. I don't have any friends yet, but hopefully uh, we can get some friends when it opens up because I'm definitely going to try to play it. Uh, that's for sure. So, yeah. And then, of course, you got your settings and stuff like that down here. That's all settings and stuff like that. So that was kind of just the... I wouldn't say an intro to the game, but it's just kind of what was on the lobby and what you could find there in the closed beta. Again, it's all uh, up for changes. It can be changed, you know, a lot of uh, feedback is going back into the game, you know, so it might not be the same when we come out, but I'm pretty sure it's going to more or less be the same, but we'll see when it opens up for you maybe an open beta or just beta for uh, anybody else and on the I don't know at this point if it's gonna be free to play or what it's gonna be but I'm pretty sure it's gonna be free to play because we have the whole cash shop and, and such so I think pretty sure it's gonna be free to play but I'm not 100% sure on that <laughs> but yeah I'm pretty sure it's gonna be anyways if you uh, thought this was pretty cool I would appreciate very much if you would give this video a like that would help me out very very much maybe a comment below as well will help the algorithm of uh, I was about to say Trove I mean of course YouTube for putting out this video to more people and we can get some people excited for this game and we can get this on the roll so thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one bye